to Washington, D.C. We go for the T-Mobile Home Run Derby. Bryce Harper representing the hometown Nationals, but he is just one of eight sluggers on display in this year's tournament, a bracket-style single elimination event with four-minute rounds, plus an extra 30 seconds tacked on for hitting two or more home runs to travel 440 feet or further. We'll start things off in the first round. Reese Hoskins putting on a show. Philly Slugger going to town against Jesus Aguilar. And he got one out the center. What a start, Reese Hoskins. And Jesus Aguilar of the Brewers could not match Hoskins 17. The big man from Milwaukee ends up with 12, so Hoskins moves on to round two. So the focus shifts to Kyle Schwarber of the Cubs, and the big man would find the upper tank at Nationals Park on Monday night, and he also caps off his first round by flexing some muscle to the opposite field. He ends up with 16 home runs in this round, so Alex Bregman of the Astros has a tall task in front of him. He gets some pep talk from his teammates and comes oh so close to tying Schwarber. Oh, that one may tie it. And listen to this crowd right there. Javier Baez takes his turn wearing the old jacket of the late great Hall of Famer and fellow Puerto Rican Roberto Clemente. Baez cracks 16 homers in the first round, but it would not be enough against Dodgers upstart Max Muncy. Baez was holding the Puerto Rican flag a few minutes ago. This is it. He That's can it. wave the white flag now. Max Muncy walks on with 35 seconds to go. Now NLE sluggers collide to close out round one. Freddie Freeman of the Braves goes deep 12 times, but he's up against the hometown hero who looks on from the dugout before putting the Stars and Stripes lumber to good use. Put your hands in. Bryce Harper would not disappoint the fans in our nation's capital with his father, Ron Harper, throwing the pitches. Harper puts on an early glimpse of what was to come. The lefty slugger goes deep 13 times, including a 467-foot bomb and a 465-footer as well. Harper ends up with just under 30 extra seconds left on the clock, but he would not need it. He easily cruises into the semifinals. And then there were four. Reese Hoskins now of the Phillies picking up right where he left off in round number one. He becomes the first participant of the night to slug 20 home runs in a single round with Kyle Schwarber looking on behind him. Big number 12 from the north side of Chicago is behind the eight ball as Hoskins peppers left field and left center at Nationals Park. But the Cubs big man was up to the challenge. He goes berserk with eight home runs in the final 65 seconds of his round. He's going to take his time here, try to hit one more. He doesn't even need it. Stay fair. That's fair. That's gone. Schwarber, 21 to advance. So who would get the face off against him in the final round? Max Muncy of the Dodgers or Bryce Harper of the Nationals? Muncy would take his turn first, and the lefty slugger belts 12 home runs in all. That is not nearly enough against Bryce Harper, who was on a mission Monday night. He gets hot around the 220 mark of his round, and he does not even need the time bonus that he accrues. Harper would get the 13 homers in the round with more than a minute 10 remaining, and he can take the rest of the round off as he cruises into the finals to take on Schwarber. So now Bryce Harper has a chance to send the D.C. fans home happy, but first he has to watch Kyle Schwarber go back to work, and the Cubs' big guy goes deep 18 times in the final round, presenting a challenge to Harper, who once again starts off slowly, but he catches fire late with nine home runs in the final 50 seconds of the round. The tie Schwarber at 18 round trippers. He has the time bonus accrued, so he takes a breather, which sets the stage for a dramatic finale. Clock stops. Wow. He's got 30 seconds. Yes. There it is. Center field, and Bryce Harper has thrown his bat in the air and won the 2018 T Mobile Home Run Derby, and he loves it. Harper's all star teammates and his manager Dave Martinez help him hoist the hardware. Bryce Harper is the third man ever to win the home run derby in his home stadium. He joins Todd Frazier, who did it at Cincinnati's Great American Ballpark in 2015, and Ryan Sandberg at Wrigley Field in Chicago back in 1990.